Oh no, I fell asleep. I'm gonna die, guys. I'm gonna die. What's up, everybody? Another day in our. What's up, everybody? Another day here at Rag Rock Rock. How's your day going? Hope it's going good. Our day is really hot here in the middle of the desert. It's so hot you can see the heat coming off it. But before I start this episode, I want to plug one of my sponsors, uh, G2A.com. Um, you can get games and gift cards there for, uh, I think, 20% off. Um, I always have the link down in the description of my videos. Um, if you use my link, um, you get 20% off, and I think I get a little bit of money out of it. But the um, main thing is you get 20% off any games and gift card. A uh, good example would be um, PlayStation Plus. Yearly subscription is you know $60 if you go to PlayStation Store. But if you go to the G2A.com website and using my link, you get it for $48. So it's a $12 um, discount that you get. Like I said, it comes out to 20%, but it, um, instead of paying 60 through PlayStation Store for the PlayStation Plus yearly subscription, you're only paying $48 through the G2A.com. I'm um, using my link. So uh, I just wanted to plug that to let people know that you can get games and gift cards on that website using my link um, and get 20% off of everything. So uh, I think it's well worth it. I got my... Uh, Places and plus yearly subscription off of there since I saved twelve dollars. So uh, check go, go out and uh, check it out. Uh, but today we're at episode two in the desert biome. If you didn't watch uh, episode one, this is where we're at down there where it says me. We're down there like the little island. I'm at what um, looks like eighty in longitude and about eighty five latitude. So that's where we're at. Can't believe it's actually raining. Um, I started a little hut. Um, episode one, I showed you I was in this area. Um, I was actually down there, um, but I see these these rock platforms um, over here. I'm like, hey, I should just build a base up here, so we're kind of away from uh, the other dinosaurs and uh, stuff that comes comes through the area, so they can't get up here to get us because we're way up on this platform. Um, you do need a flyer to get up here, or you can make a ladder, maybe. Um, but anyways, that's what I decided to go. There's that island you can see, you, you saw it on the map as well. And uh, I started my little hut using uh, Adobe. Um, got a little bit of ceiling going on here. Got my some ceilings. Um, I got the forge. I need still need to make a smithy. When I get the smithy going. Uh, I'll be pretty pretty well set um, since I got everything else. Um, but. To make these walls and foundations of the adobe, man, you need a lot of clay. Um, I have clay right here. I got 146. Um, but to show you, to make clay, to make clay, you need um, the cactus sap and sand. Um, as you see, I got a lot of cacti cac cactus sap here. Um, sand, obviously, we're in the desert. It's pretty. <laughs> you come by it pretty quickly. Um, so many walls I can make. I, I think I got all the materials to make adobe wall. Yeah, I do. Uh, I can make three right now. So to make one wall, you need 40 clay, 8 fiber, 10 thatch, and 20 wood. So, I mean, the clay is the problem. It's just because it's, you know, it's time consuming to get all that kafka sap and sand. Um, but, so with all the materials I had in there, I can only make three walls. But let's get these three walls. Let's get these walls up. At least I get, um... So at least I got some walls around me. But as you see, I still don't... Oh, there you go. I finally got the little house. Symbol over there on the right-hand corner of the screen there. So I do get the houses since I have one ceiling up. So, before I did not have this house symbol. So that tells me that you need at least a square hut like this. See, I got it again. Um, you need at least all your walls going to be attached to each other. So it, 
you know, if you had one foundation and four walls, that would be enough in a roof. It would give you the house. But uh, if you don't have walls connected to each other, you do not get the little house symbol that's over on the right-hand corner. So that's very interesting to know. So when they go over here in the desert biome, at least uh, since, since I have the little house over there, it thinks I'm inside, so I'm cooler. Um, see, the, the heat symbol down in the below went, went away. My sunburn's still there, but my heat's gone. And see, now I'm back out here, um, outside, and the heat thing's back. So, at least I got some of it up. Now I just got to concentrate on what I need. Uh, one, let's see, what I need, what? One, two, three, four, five, six. I need six more walls, and then probably six ceilings. So I got enough clay, I just need more, well, I really don't have a lot of clay, so. So see, those three walls took all my uh, clay, so now I gotta go get some more um, sand. Cause I don't think I have any more sand. I had the sap. But I don't think I have the sand. No, I don't have any more sand. So I gotta go get some more sand. Well, sand you get out of rocks. And there are small rocks too that you could pick up off the ground and get the sand as well. So you get more sand with a um, pickaxe or with a hatchet than you do a pickaxe. And of course you need you know so you can't get all these little s small stones for some reason. Which I don't understand, but it is what it is. They don't let you use all these little rocks, I guess. Yeah, how much did I? So I got 38 sand out of those. So you can't pick up any of those. So you got a lot of small rocks here that you can't do anything with. You know, some deserts they have where you can, uh, there's like little pockets of sand that you can pick up. But I haven't found any over here in the, this new desert biome yet. I did a little, I did find a little rock so you could pick up off the ground without using a pickaxe or a hatchet, but I have not found the little pockets of sand. So I'm encumbered here. So let's go back, see how many walls and that I can make now. But yeah, and see the, the, these little rock platforms are pretty cool, guys. Um, where you can kind of get off of the ground and um, get away from dinos that are on the ground. Okay. So I got 75 sand, so I can make 37 uh, clays. And then I'll just need wood, since I got enough fiber and um, fats for now. So it's, like, it's, it just seems like it's real time consuming to make um, this adobe uh, house. It's because you just need so much clay. And, you know, it, it just takes time. I can show you, too, where you get this cactus sap. Because the uh, only cactuses i found so far are kind of a little ways from here. Um, it's not in the desert. It's kind of like on off to the side of the desert. But, let's see. Never. Like I said, I've never really played, um... Scorch Earth. So I'm not really sure about a lot of this stuff. In the desert... I never really um, did Scorch Earth, so I'm not really sure what a lot of this stuff does. So I will make a water well sometime here, too, to show you guys what that does. So I'm making a decent amount of clay, but see, I still don't have enough wood. 
But see right now I'm up to 40 clay and then would how many clay you need for one? So for one wall you need 40 clay. I mean so I mean it just it takes time just because you need so much resources. So I was able to make 68 more. I was just stacked in my cactus sap there, so it makes it takes up less room. So Make one more, but I think this time to hear it, yeah. Like, so I can make one more if I get a little bit more wood. Okay, so I can make one more wall. So I was able to get four more walls up. <clears throat> now this will show you where you get the cactus sap. Oh, two guys. I, I uh, tamed a dolphin, too. Um, and with dolphin, you just need regular meat to tame him. He was stuck, so uh thought it was... <laughs> Since he was stuck and couldn't move, I figured out, I'll tame him. Easy tame. Okay. So I'll throw these four walls up. I'm a hard time seeing that one. Okay, there it is. At least now I can get some ceilings up here, so I'm gonna end up not needing a whole lot more um, walls. So I need what? Two more, two more walls, and then I'll need one, two, oh, just four ceilings. So sweet. Okay, got my little house thing there. See, for a secondary item, my little house thing. And the heat thing should go away. Yep, see the heat goes away. So, so four more, or two more walls and four ceilings. So I will go show you where to get the cactus sap. There's a spino. Oh, the spino's attacking that dinosaur. And here's the cactuses, guys. As you can see them. Snake. Okay, there they are. Oops. Well, the snake can get up here or not? Yep. Oh crap! Oh, there's uh, is that a cat? Dang cat there! Okay, we'll go up here. <laughs> Give you the coordinates. I can't believe there's a cat over here. Okay, pull the map up. Okay, the coordinates for here is, you see, is we're by that little, little inlet um, of water there. So we are at roughly 70 longitude and 80 latitude is the coordinates for where this, these cactuses are. So 70 longitude and 80 latitude, roughly. That's where we're at. Get this cactus. You can see him down there. Try to get away from these things here. Show you. So you do get a lot of cactus sap out of these things. So there's the cacti, cacti. So right there you get 23 thatch and you get, I got 16 cactus sap. So you get a lot of sap out of uh, one cactus. And see I got 31 um, sap already. Just out of two. Oh. Oh crap. Oh crap! What the hell? I oh, mean, we're a disaster. I'm gonna die.
Oh no, I fell asleep. <sighs> I'm gonna die, guys. I'm gonna die. Here comes the snake. I'm dead. At least I got your coordinates before I died. I'm trying to go in the circles because the thing won't hit me. Well, I'm doing the circles. Sometimes. I don't know if I can pop up and run after I get up here or is the snake's gonna get me again. See if I can make it. Run! Get up on him. Can't quite get on okay, it. There we go. Whew. Whew, whew, whew. That was close, guys. That was close. <laughs> that was close. Too close. I lost my shirt. Okay, let's get back. <laughs> but yeah, see, there's no uh, cactus on this side of the river there, which is kind of strange. But at least I was able to escape the disaster. They got you the coordinates where the cactuses are, so that's cool. <sighs> Lord, that guy's that was close. That was close. Can't believe we got out of there. Stupid snake, anyways. See, I think I got a shirt I can put on here. Yep, I got a shirt. Okay. Whew. Can't believe we made it out of there alive, guys. But yeah, here, guys. Here's these little, little rocks you can pick up. See, can, these rocks, um, normally you just get the normal just stone. You actually get stone and sand out of them. So, uh, so if you, if you pickaxe broke or anything, um, you can just find these little rocks. They're normally in these little areas where you have these trees. Um, you'll you'll find these little rocks, and you can pick them up. Of course, you can pick up sticks too. But uh, yeah, just I just wanted to show you that. Got to actually stop this area. Look at these little rocks. So, like I said, if you break your pickaxe, <clears throat> you can still gather some sand for a little bit. It takes a little longer, but. The scorpion see me? No. So I got see I got 44 sand out of those rocks. So do you need a pickaxe and got 44 sand? So a little good little uh, tip to let you know about since you can't find those little uh, sand pockets I was talking about earlier. So the second alternative is at least get nose. Got a little sand here. Head back. Let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do his melee. His melee is not the greatest. And uh, not the no, most exciting uh, episode, but you know, stuff you kind of have to do um, is build your bases and stuff. At least I was able to show you guys. And I need to build a smithy too. What do I need to make make a smithy? It's the really the last thing I need to do over here. Uh, to really get things going. This is a smithy. Let's see, I need five metal ingots, twenty hide. I don't know if I have twenty hide or not. Got everything else. Do I got hide in here? No hide in here. I know I had some hide somewhere. What did I do with it? I got my 20 mineral ingots in there. Is it in one of the dinosaurs? I thought I had some hide left. Uh, oh, look. I just have enough hide. Nice. <laughs> I don't think he has any. And nope. He has some polymer, but that's it. At least <laughs> I have just enough. 
should have everything else. I might have to get some wood, but it's no big deal. Oh, well, I went in here and see. I need a stone. Let's see. Oh, I already got enough stone. I got in the hide. I just need wood. Looks like I need eight more wood or something like that. Let's see. Yep, got enough metal. Just throw five of those in. Give me a little bit of my wood. I think after I do this, I'll call it the. Yep. Go put the smithy in place and call it a day for s episode two. Oh, look, look at that. I gotta level up. So I will be a level 76. I need some dang shoes too, huh? I'll pump my weight. Get my weight up. Oops. Get back on. Get back on the griffin. Get back on that griffin. All right. So my hut is uh, coming in uh, play here. Not looking too bad. I will extend it as I go, but I want to at least get the walls up and uh, ceiling up. Okay, where am I going to put the smithy at? See, I'm going to extend this thing. The smithy's probably going to... I'll put it on this wall. I won't extend this wall out. The other wall I'll probably extend out. Alright, got the smithy. Look how far away they want you to put it against, away from the wall. I, I don't understand that. It's like it's in the middle of the room. And Chris, I can almost walk back there. But as you saw, it wouldn't let me put it any further back. So guys, we got our little fort going here. I just need a couple more walls and three more ceilings. And it'll be complete. Like I said, I will add on as I go. But I just wanted to kind of get the foundation down for a, um, a little fort and all the stuff I need I mean really this is really all you need to um, get started guys is this a forge smithy and your mortar and pedestal it's really all you need and of course a bed too in case you die um, this is all you really need for a little fort to start out with to get your basic materials going um, so you can build stuff so next episode maybe we'll go tame a dinosaur and uh I might, meanwhile, before the next episode, I might finish this up to get the walls and ceiling up. And then after that, um, I'll do uh, another episode and maybe go tame something and uh, see what's going on. But I hope you like this episode. If there's anything uh, you want me to tell you, just leave it in the comments below. And I hope you enjoyed this episode. And before you leave, please smash that like button. Yeah, or smash that dislike button. Either one helps me. And please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And until next time, see ya!